Let's see what's here. Oh shit. Wait. I hear something. Eve, look up. Yo. That is a bayonetta looking ass enemy right here. Yo, the music though, hold on. I gotta do this shit to get up faster. I definitely press Okay bruh. Okay game. I definitely press the dodge button right there. You don't you you can't be for real right now. That, that's so Why is it making me back this? This game don't make no sense. Oh my god, I'm dead. Hold up. Alright. Bitch ass nigga. Fuck out of here. First try, nigga. Yes, sir. Cook this ass. Oh my god, that's tough. God damn. Whew. That was, that was, whew. Yeah, that, that shit was fire, bro. I did not expect to be done my first shot. I had to run all my heels with that one. <clears throat> Jeez. A final fight? It did sound like a final goodness. boss. I can't believe this. That shit was good. that shit that fight was fire, bro. This is the Alpha Natiba. I actually like that boss fight. You I hope this game has a boss rush. Cool. Or you can fight the these bosses again. Alpha core. Were you the one who sent the rescue signal? Uh huh? Oh yes. Oh, she's yes, pretty. It was me. You're a member of the seventh airborne squad, right? Yes. And you? Right. Let me introduce myself. I'm an engineering support of the 5th Airborne Squad. Lily Artemis II. Uh, Lily. But you can just call me Lily. <laughs> bro, the music, bro. Oh my god, bro. They don't gotta go this hard, bro. <sighs> this game don't got no misses with the soundtrack. So just to recap, you were in that hideout waiting for another squad to arrive for almost two years? <clears throat> and then you met us. Yes, 
Thank you so Two years. much for saving Damn. me. Currently, Zion is holding out under the guidance of Orkoth, who is also our spiritual leader. It's complicated. Eve. I imagine completing Yeah, the King of Us for way is long as hell. That trailer comments. dropped like almost three years ago, I so, think. Please help me save Zion. Zion. Damn, this place looks crazy. <clears throat> wow! Look at that! It's huge! It's surprising to see a city in a place like this. <clears throat> During its prime, over a hundred thousand people called it home. Obviously, now there are fewer. The place you see below is my safe house. The auxiliary engine's output is weak, so things can get bumpy. Hold on tight. <coughs> wow! A whole city underneath the wasteland. <coughs> it's amazing. Even in the darkest times, it's always safe to bet on human survival instinct. So, where do we go? <clears throat> no time for breaks. Typical Eve. I'm gonna see you ready. Oracle is in the presence chamber. Oh, this whole joint is. Use camps to steal this fire. Looks like they built the city deep and high. Planet Diamond Suit 6. Ooh. Oh, this is the pre order outfit. And it was this the deluxe edition outfit. Oh, snap. Oh, they put them here. Stargazer suit. Alright, y'all. We got some new outfits. Lily's clothes, Adams. Oh, you can change their clothes too. Oh, wow. Off the door here. I don't like the earrings. Damn. Nah, Eve looking good. Hold on, Cuff. We got a new pod. <clears throat> we got glasses now. We got on these. And then we got the planet diving suit. Six. Yeah, this is definitely the best planet diving suit. This is guys. Stargazer suit. Oh my lord. This shit is bro, this is bro, this outfit is fire, bro. Crit boost gear. Increase crit rate. Yeah, I use shield destruction gear against that boss, but we're gonna increase the crit rate. So we got 9.5 now. It, it was Wow, what is this place? I wonder how the colony would react if they knew about this! <laughs> Most likely there will be a protocol to rescue everyone. It'll be a big project. But the only way it'll be possible to contact the colony yeah, will be to like finish the mission. <laughs> I'm pretty sure all these motherfuckers gonna do it. This is a post-apocalyptic world. Adam, why are the streets so empty? Is everyone hiding because of yeah. us? We have a situation here. <laughs> a situation? Somebody made me some ramen or something, bro. You'll see. 
when you get to the presence chamber. What the hell is this? Hey, Rael. It's been a while. Looks like you brought guests. Very important guests. Can you open the door? Go. Oracle is waiting for you. <clears throat> See you soon, Rael. Rael. Rael is a mysterious warrior who protects the presence. Chamber citizens of Scion call her the Royal Guard. Some say she was an assassin. Some say she is a native who turned against her own kind after being enlightened by the prophet. And some even say that she is a prototype angel. All rumors aside, one thing is crystal clear. Rayo will do anything for Orku and Sion. Sion. Okay. Taiki. Taiki is a commanding officer of the South Airborne Squad. They said that in that colony combat situation her speed was unmatched the name is Taki for a really good reason Squad so gets obliterated by Natibas well so Natibas is the enemies basically <clears throat> while well, entering and we've seen that at the beginning of the game that they got fucked up <laughs> while well, entering the earth's atmosphere however the mission is still a go Taki finds Eve and intends to regroup with their squad yet the Natibas onslaught practically wipes out Taki's squad to make matters worse and identify Natiba's strikes without warning, leaving both Taki and Eve at death's door. In this desperate moment, Taki sacrifices herself to save Eve. There's still life in the flames of hope. <clears throat> Later on, Miss Second is an engineer supporter of the Fifth Airplane Squad. Although she is a bit small, she is a fully grown individual. Also, she's a grown ass woman. <laughs> they had to make that clear. She's not a lolly. Well, she is a lolly. But. And. An official member of the Airborne Squad, due to an accurate recording, she was dropped to an isolated place and was forced to wait for another squad to rescue her. As the title suggests, she is skilled at maintaining bodies and equipment of Airborne Squads and can use almost all her technology without any hazard and the perfect support. Her only flaws are that she is a bit snobbish and speaks strangely sometimes. Adam is a scavenger of Scion. He saves E's life from an undefined Atiba, though. Eve did not trust him at first. Adam suggests that he and Eve work together, and so they arrive at 807 after their business at 807. So Adam tells Eve about Sion the last minute, so he suggests that he and Eve work together even further. Adam is unlikely a scavenger. He's, his safe house features at various facilities like an airport, etc. He even has a silver tongue, is persuaded Oracle to support Eve. He is definitely an ordinary person. Ooh. <clears throat> okay, it was cool to read about the characters. Yeah, that's a lot of niggas. Over here. Yo, who this old nigga? Oh. I see we have guests. Welcome. Oracle. Oh, that's Oracle. Let me start the introduction. <laughs> This is Zion's prophet, Oracle. I'm Airborne Squad member Eve. My name's Lily. Pleased to meet you. Adam has told me all about you. You defeated an Alpha Nativa. Could you show me anything it might have dropped? Yeah. Niggas like me be sick as hell. Oh. It's an alpha core. Please, a moment. Your objective is to rid the world of the Elder Natiba, the leader of all other <coughs> Natibas. Well, then I suppose you're trying to use the alpha core as a key to open the way forward to the nest. Is that right? How did you know that? Unfortunately, the nest cannot be opened with the Alpha Core alone. What? No way! But is... is there really no other way to reach the nest? By fusing four Alpha Cores together, <coughs> you create something called a Master Core. <coughs> Only with the Master Core will you be able to reach the very deepest corner of the nest. How... 
How do you know all this? Thanks to my personal link to the facility on the surface, I can search anywhere and everywhere on Earth. All I require is the right amount of energy. That would also mean you'd be able to track down the Alpha Natiba. That's enough for introductions. Adam, please insert the hypercell. Oh, hey. Please hey, follow here. Adam. Place is messy. <clears throat> bro, where was we carrying that in our pocket, bro? <laughs> that big ass hypercell that we got, we was carrying that joint in our pockets, literally. <clears throat> People here are in a deep sleep due to energy depletion. <clears throat> Carrying on this way, I can only bring darkness. But we as German. Dave, please help us. Thanks to the hypercell Eve acquired, they're safe. For the time being. I'm glad I was able to do something of significance. Do we need more hypercells if the citizens ever want to wake up? Yes. We need three more hypercells if we ever want to fully rebuild Zion. Let's go back to Oracle and you can hear the rest of the story. Outsiders, thank you for your hard work. Thanks to you, the lives of tens of thousands of people have been extended. And my personal link is also stabilizing. That's great news! I wonder if Bro ever gets uncomfortable sitting in that position. So I definitely would. All the elders' energy. Who the hell is this? Bro, he look cool though. <clears throat> who, who are you? I just said that, Lily. <laughs> oh, this here is man, a sentinel commander. He also serves as Oracle's bodyguard. My skills are still limited, shelves, so I am not yet able to reach new areas. However, with the power of more hypercells, I'm certain I can track the location of the Alpha Nativa. That's why I'll have to ask you for a little more help. Altus Lavoir, a place out in the wasteland, a ruin of the past. Can we count on you to retrieve another hypercell from there? Eve, I'm sure it'll be of help. Yes, we have no other choice. Adam, Lily, I'll be counting on you. It won't be easy. Man. <clears throat> Make sure to be well prepared. My boy got J Lux. What else we got? Oh, this is all this shit we got right here. Shit. Black or white? Let's go. Let's go white. Oh, yeah. And I was saving my skills, right? Yeah. Oh my. You can see. You can see. Do the. Oh wow. <laughs> hey man. Can't blame a nigga, can you? Shoot, let me talk to her. Adam sent me to pick I can't up believe the angel is here. I'm here. Is it ready? Hmm. Uh huh. It's ready. I even have a spare one too. 
Good to know. Let's see. How much is that going to cost? Oh, no, no, no. You, you can just take this. I, uh, heard you come to help us. O of course, I'll do what I can to help you as well. She is very shy, y'all. Yeah. Really? Then I'll accept it. Thank you. In return, Man, is there chest something is else I can maybe help you with? The physics go crazy. Huh? Oh, no, no. <laughs> it's just that you looked like you had something weighing on your mind. <gasps> Did I now? Oh, I guess I can't hide anything from you, Angel. Do you want to give me the full story? All right. One day, I was out working in the scrap plains of the wasteland when I ran into some Natibas. I had to ditch my bike and my trunk during the escape. The bike got caught between hunks of metal. I had to leave it behind. A bike? Can you give me the exact location? I do have to go out to the wasteland. I'll go ahead and find out. Oh! oh thank you very much! Doing a side missions, y'all. Oh, I was just playing to view. You can become friends with merchants if you use their shops off of this. Put down roads. Your items will become. Okay. Well, I don't really know what I need now. I'll definitely come back. I'll be right back though. I'm heading out. Ah, yes. Yes. Bulletin board. Ah, Angel. Lovely to meet you. Roxanne. You. You don't seem very likable. <laughs> All right, you're pretty sharp. I've heard it before. Folks often compare me to a snake. I'm Roxanne. Consider me a kind of info dealer. Info dealer? Yes, practical things. Gossip, blackmail, fears, weaknesses. I dabble in a bit of everything. Info dealer. Oh, I do like this, Angel. You really are my favorite customer. Our shop it will be updated in the data bank after purchase. Information solar tower from all over the world. The solar towers, solar tower appears to be a simple and friendly power suit. I don't know what these are for though. Information is gold, silver, and jewels. Take a look around. I already have this suit, right? Oh my god! This is fire! I don't know what the fuck these are. Uh, second, I think we're just gonna buy it. For a cutie like you, I'm willing to go beyond my reach to get what you want. Vita coins. Alright, chat, what are we buying? This game got mad fire outfits, bro. Oh, honey, that's so. 
I guess we gonna use all these outfits throughout the playthrough. All these outfits. Three, zero, four, two, seven, two. I would have never guessed that because I didn't even know I had to do math. Oh, they make it so you can just instantly travel. Thank you. That's fire. Looks a little bit should be. Yes, ma'am. And yeah, we got Bitcoin. I mean, Bitcoin. Alright, now we are gonna do. Got a can. Bad animation so far. I'll be back. Let me go check for my food. But that doesn't mean you can go Bruh. around as you please. This area right here is so far. The music. Of course, those who've lived in the comfort of God the damn. Don't know anything. I don't mean any harm. The music so far. If I've caused you trouble. And then, and yet, this a whole rest okay. area too. This is beautiful, y'all. What is up with that, though? There was a time when this bar used to be full of people. Now it's just so empty. Empty and dark. And Enya? I need to always see for this right now. I wonder how long she can keep singing with her body. In the oh, that's her song. singing the song. Uh, I don't even know why I'm talking about this. It's pointless. I'm trying to be sensitive. Yeah, this is sad, man. If you need help, we might be able to fix her. After all, we do have engineering support from the Airborne Squad. What? Is that so? But I... I have no way to repay you. No, I don't need anything. I don't need any kind of incentive to save someone. All right. In that case... Could you help me? Of course, man. This is a really cool rest area, though. Like, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Behemoth Red. That looks fire. Huh. A drone? Stretch your arm out in front of you. Oh, I'm about to get the gun. <laughs> the drone is different. Yes, this is no longer the drone you knew. It's an all-new, upgraded Drone 2.0 that can launch long-range projectiles. Man, that's fire. No, this is more than just an upgrade. It's an evolution! Bro, we get the gun, bro. Yo, Lily. <laughs> Lily, a real one. Now try hitting the target. Let's try. <laughs> I pray. Now, right on target again. Now, focus. <laughs> I was trying my hardest to smack that joint. That's amazing, Lily. Colony Tech at your service. What do you think? <laughs> trying my hardest to hit that target, bro. My head was struggling. It'll be very useful for the mission. Thanks, Lily. <laughs> Great. Let me know if you ever run out of ammunition. Range attack. Oh no, I'm about to use that drone. Oh. 
So do we unlock a new tree? Features unlocked. Oh. Drone high security. I have three upgraded slug slugs. I have twenty percent higher attack power. Attach this your missile pod missiles. Shotgun shells. We don't get the rockets. Oh yeah, it's fire. I, I'm starting to like this place. The wasteland. The lone and level sands stretch far away. This is the largest land I've ever seen in my life. And yet danger lurks around every corner. Watch your step. If you trip, you might find yourself caught in the arms of death. All right. I've entered the scant coordinates of Altus Lavoir. Let's go. The music. <laughs> 